Hi y'all, I wanna take a quick second and speak to the parents who are listening today. First of all, be encouraged. Your kids staying home may seem like an inconvenience, I know, but I want you to see it as an opportunity to invest in your children, right? These are blessings from God, and so look at it as an opportunity. You were made to lead your kids, and you have what it takes, so be encouraged. This pandemic has caused much of, if not all, of what we have known to be normal to be flipped on end. In a world that didn't and doesn't like to slow down, consider that this may be the opportunity that God is using to tell us to slow down. If we're honest, we know and have known the truths from His Word. In Luke 10, Jesus, the Son of God and God Himself, praised Mary and reminded Martha that slowing down is good. We can look at even his life and see that Jesus routinely made an effort to rest, to pray, to fast, to sit, and to make his time flexible. I'm realizing myself that there are areas of my life that before the pandemic used to seem important, but in hindsight may still be important but may also be time fillers, or uh, at very best, maybe good things that are getting in the way of great things. If you could, comment below and tell us what the Lord may be telling you is a good thing in your life that might be getting in the way of something better, something great, something eternal. For me, my time with my family has always been good, and I've heard it said by many that my family comes first. And I'd like to push back on that for just a moment. Would you entertain that God should come first and that family should come second? Where do you put work on that list? What about social activities, sports, entertainment? Y'all, I am guilty of allowing Satan, our true enemy, to influence me, my spending, my leadership in my home, my surrender to the Lord, my rearing of my children, and too much more. Due to the COVID-19 virus, the old normal is gone. And praise God, today starts a renewed life dedicated to my Lord. And then my family. See y'all later.